So my name is Blanca Herrera, and I teach at Ida Jew Academies in the Mount Pleasant School District in East San Jose. Ida Jew Academies uh, offers three different academies to students, and our population, for the most part, um, is low socioeconomic, but it has become quite diverse because we have out-of-district uh, students. So last summer at Lockheed Martin, and my job was to help an engineer um, review all their different programs to make sure that they were still functioning and got to learn you know what it basically goes into creating the software to control the satellites which is quite extensive very detailed and so I got to learn a little bit about the application of you know how computer programming helps um, create you know something as big as a satellite that goes into space I really left with a real sense of pride that these people had because they worked together in collaboration, which is what we're trying to instill in our kids. Um, you know, they come together to create something that's bigger than themselves. And um, that really left me coming, wanting to come back and tell the kids, you know, you can learn so much, you can contribute, you can be contributors to a big team effort and come up with, you know, s such a big product. Like one of the biggest things was the Hubble telescope when I went to see the movie. And to think, you know, it was done down the street in Sunnyvale, you know, by people that lived here, you know, just made me want to come running, tell the kids, hey, you know, when you grow up, you can be, you know, the next generation of engineers, of scientists that can come up with the, you know, the next big thing too. I want I wanted to kind of replicate that experience for the kids, give them an opportunity because I think at this age our personality is flourishing and we're trying, trying to find out what we like, what we don't like. And I wanted to give them, you know, at least this experience to see if maybe computer programming might be something that they do enjoy as well. My educational transfer plan is designed to teach students not just an introduction, an introduction to computer programming, but also to touch upon the um, very important concepts in fifth grade science that all students need to learn. My name is Monica and I'm in sixth grade. The project I'm working on is about the water cycle and like how it works and like basically like the whole nature of it. So like the precipitation, evaporation, condensation. It's like all of that sending it into what little kids can understand. What's actually really good about programming is that it teaches little kids um, at an early age like what you can do with a computer. My name is Alejandro and I'm in seventh grade. To make the project, I'm using Alice and also I'm using GarageBand to record my voice. I've learned making the, the little guy walk. It's more complex than just saying walk because you have to design every little movement in the body. My name is Valerie Regis and I'm in sixth grade. My project is about skeletons, how many bones you have in your body. I'm using a skeleton in a classroom that's, use, that's telling the students what, their, what the body does for them. Alice is most about like cartoon style stuff and GarageBand where you speak out or music. So if you could put those two together and make a cartoon. What I like about Alice is you get to use your own characters and make them move. I'm giving them an opportunity to have creative freedom to, to, to do something that they like, you know, and, and just develop that because I don't think we give them enough opportunities to do that in class. It's fostered a sense of, of big responsibility, you know, that we have as educators to give these kids a world-class education. And, you know, and having real-world experiences is one of those components to that. Um, so I, it's, it's been really positive.